and scratches. Mm -hmm. Did you sleep good? You snored like a freight train. Mm hmm. You're a good girl. Oh, yeah. guys we are in the town of Morristown New York and it is right on the St. Lawrence River so if you look across here straight over there that's Canada we left for like a week ago again you could swim still. across <laughs> love the name of this boat wind down oh cute <laughs> so this this is a public park and it was on the app I overlander is a place some people had stayed at with no problems the yeah. park itself closes, but there's a... Um, yeah, they have a big grassy parking lot over there that you can park your truck and trailers and leave there while you have your boats out doing whatever. So we're just parked there now because we're leaving, but uh, we're parked out in the grassy field. and People go my way, very friendly town, a lot of Amish. I went for a run this morning and I saw probably six, five or six different Amish buggies. You had a race with some buggies. <laughs> well, Clip I was top, racing. Clip they top. were trying to catch me coming up the hill and I wasn't having it, so... Uh, They'll be telling that story for years. He to had come. more horsepower than the horses. <laughs> They're probably just laughing at me. They're right. <laughs> Crazy English men. But those uh, bathrooms right there have showers, free showers. Yeah. So nice. Anyway, we're gonna head on up the along the river and check out whatever is to see. I don't. Yeah, we don't know. So we're gonna go up St. Lawrence River a little bit further and then start heading like southeastish and get into the. Adirondack. Hey, I said it right. Yeah. That's been a tough word for me to say. <laughs> Adirondacks. Adirondack. We're almost to Vermont, really, if you look at a map. We could be there today if we wanted, but we're it, not going it's to. probably going to take us four or five days to get there because it's just, I think we went 60 miles yesterday. We might go 60 today, but there's just so much to stop and look at. There's no reason to bypass it to go see something else when you're just not in a yeah. hurry. It's just little warmer today than I thought it was going to be. The forecast yeah. said rain, but it's... It was chilly overnight. By chilly, I mean, I mean 45. Yeah. So not really chilly. You can judge the temperature in the van by what the dog does. <laughs> if she wakes us up to climb under the covers, it's a cold. It's, it's below 50. <laughs> <laughs> and there's no denying her. She's no. coming in. <laughs> she hardly has any hair. You can't blame her. Well, she she doesn't stay covered up. You cover her up, and then she flops around. She flips around. and flops, and then this is the funniest thing she does. She's got us trained. She'll go till you wake up and cover her up, and then she's fine. So that happens all night long. All night long. My ears are tuned. I've got mom ears, so the second she starts <laughs> like that, I wake up, cover her up. Yeah. That dog. She's got me trained good. Shall we? Let's do. We shall. Carry on. Oh. oh, oh go ahead. <laughs> we're working on a van song. Is that what you were going to yeah. say? <laughs> Irene's writing a van song. Carry on. Carry on. <laughs> Bond. Stay tuned for that. This is a highway rest stop. We're probably five minutes from Cranberry Lake and it's quarter after five. We didn't know exactly where we we're gonna stay there. There's some free dispersed camping apparently, but we saw this parking area rest stop. Thought we'd check it out and there's nobody here. There's no signs that say no overnight parking, it just says clean up your trash. 
Someone's even had a fire pit here in this spot, but this is crazy. Ah, it's happening. Maybe I'll get the drone up in the morning. It's happening. <laughs> you guys check this spot out we got a little bit lucky we were starting to get worried we had a couple spots on from freecampsites.net that we we're going to go to tonight so we goofed off all day long you know it's like 3 30 we got to find a place to stay we go in there there's this place only has like two two spots <laughs> one was taken and one was a mud hole because of the rain yeah so luckily this spot is only like a mile away and it's a pretty rough road. Right on a lake. I don't even know what lake that is, but sure it is Durant gorgeous. Lake. Durant. Anyway, we're getting dinner going before it gets too cold. It's uh, gonna get chilly tonight, I can tell. We're gonna get cozy in the van, crank the heater, watch a movie. Drink a beer. Burr, too cold for that. Well, how are you doing it? I want a hot apple cider. <laughs> Dang, that sounds really good, actually. What do you got going there? Uh, cauliflower and corn, and Dave's got some fish. Mm. All right, see ya.